Good day folks, welcome back to Shotgun Versus. Today we're taking a look at an unusual object. Something right out of the kitchen. A kettle! Now, as anyone who owns one of these knows, it's made of metal and it's rounded, so something like this is uh, going to be a really difficult thing for the birdshot to puncture if it doesn't hit it right or doesn't hit it with enough force. So I think it's going to be interesting to see what happens when you shoot a kettle at reasonably close range with birdshot. Uh, my prediction, I don't think the birdshot is going to seriously damage the kettle. Like I said, because it's round, uh, it's a lot easier for it to deflect the shot. It is metal. Metal tends to be... Uh, metal's one of the toughest things we look at on this show. So it tends to take the impacts very well. And because it's aluminum, it's going to absorb the impact a little bit because it's going to cave a little bit. So that's my prediction. So, set it up and see what happens. Well, I am genuinely surprised at this. Here's where the bird shot hit it. It tore, it tore right through this thing. I'm, I am genuinely shocked. There's actually bird shot in here. There's some of the pellets from the bird shot. And as you can see, while a lot of it hit and stopped, some of it punched right through and kept going. Like that, that's incredible. I'm, I'm, I am shocked at that. So the majority of the shot hit here, the rest of it was scattered around, and even some of the individual shots punched right through, which is impressive. And then the majority of the shot went through that hole and out here where it kept going into the ground. And some of the individual shots also punched through. So yeah, that's that's incredible. I'm I'm very impressed. So while this may save you from the bulk of the shot, you're still getting shot. <laughs> That's amazing. Wow, point for bird shot.